Oh, MTV. Welcome to our new crib. So yeah, this is me and my girlfriend celebrating buying our first ever house together. Pretty crazy. You're probably wondering, why the hell did we do this? Let me explain. To catch some of you up to speed, this is how me and Claudia met. We met during a collab. I acted like a fool. Next thing you know, she was into that fool. But I was living in Los Angeles at the time, so I had to make the move all the way back to New Jersey, and I would constantly commute up and down to Maryland. And after a while, I eventually just had to get an Airbnb to move in officially and become a Marylander. We are not expecting in 2023 that we are going to be buying a house, but out of nowhere, we were like, what if we did that? What if we got our own house? We could build a gym. We could do so many cool things. So we started looking and luckily we found something literally first try. Me and my beautiful girlfriend went and searched a house today. We called our realtor and we said to put in our first offer and we're waiting to hear back. Guys, I'm fine. This house had so many rooms. It looked awesome. We could film with all the window lighting. I could have a gym in the garage. There was literally nothing wrong with this house at all. This is our dream home. I'm sweating. I just feel like I'm gonna pass out like, and puke big, everywhere. It's such a big. Yeah, it's huge. Life choice. Yeah. And it's also like we didn't even think about this. It's been no. such a fast process. It's the first house we looked at, but because it's like so beautiful. Yeah. Ah, uh, adulting! And honestly, might sound stupid, might sound crazy, but we went into contract within a few days. Oh, Bobby. What? Guess what? We're under contract. What? Ooh, yeah! Literally that quick. So we had to let some people know. We are officially under contract. And because it was so amazing, we are now in contract. Everything was going so well. It was time to show Claudia and her family. Holy. Yeah, yeah. It's oh actually insane, bro. Man, I, I think it's kind of small. Did you <laughs> oh, yeah, man. This is, this is the this only room you get to see. The most insane part is the bathroom, man. Oh, bro. Yeah. Holy. Look at it. We can shower and yeah. stare at each other's eyes. <laughs> yeah, totally. I can't wait. <laughs> Literally, this place has just like, there's just like way too much. This is so cool. It's so sick. Jen, oh, yeah. honest, Jesse. honest opinion. What are you thinking? Uh, like, uh, like it's a 20 out of they don't 10. Have to be like All right. It seems like everything's just going perfect until this happens. All right, I just got out of the gym. I actually have bad news and it sucks. Um, I just got off the phone at my dad. There is no internet. How does a place that nice, that amazing, that expensive, not have internet? Out of all things, we literally can't live here. It's, a, it's, not, it's not going to work at all. So unfortunately, and I hate to say this because it's the most disappointing part leading up to this point, is that we no longer are in contract for this home. So we are back to square one, search for houses. We kept searching for houses, but it was so difficult to find one as good as the last. After many hours of searching, we finally landed on the next house. Hint, hint, it's this one. I'm in it right now. But because of the way the last house went, we were gonna take things slow and have much less expectations. So let's go check it out. Now the best part about this place is that it truly feels like home. A place where we could have holidays, our family and friends can come visit. We could have friends over for, you know, some fancy drinks, some nights out or something. Not that we really do that, but we could. We literally could. This place is just very beautiful and very homey. And we love the location. We didn't get our hopes up because we knew at any moment during this process, all can fail and we won't get this house. So we just kind of looked and just took it in for what it was. Now there was other people bidding on this house, so we had to act quick and put in an offer. So they got a sign and then we're back in contract again. <laughs> yeah, a week later. And just like that, we were in contract once again. Yeah! House number two in contract, baby! Hopefully it all works out and um, I'll let you know, I mean, that's pretty nuts. I'm getting a home. This house was about to be ours. Our dream home. I better have a room. <laughs> Uncle Joey! <laughs> Uncle Joey! No! Yes! No! No! Not yet! <laughs> not yet, guys! <laughs> One thing at a time. There are things that could still go wrong at any moment. Till you sign that paper, it is not your house. Today is the day. Ladies and gentlemen, Claudia and I are going to be official 
homeowners. We're doing a final walkthrough and making sure everything that was inspected is fixed. And then, what do we have at four? We sign the paper. This home is ours, baby. So we headed over to the real estate agent, met up with them, did our inspection, and got ready to sign those papers. Ladies and gentlemen, we have just signed a 700 page book of papers and we are now officially homeowners. Wow. Congrats, babe. Congrats to us both. I love you. I couldn't be more excited for what is going to be happening at this house besides just enjoying it and living in it. There is so much content to be made. There's so many memories to be made. And there's just overall just good times with my friends and family to be had. But before this house was ours, we gotta do the hard part and move. In a classic Jesse fashion, I waited last minute to move out. It was definitely sentimental going through everything and reliving all the memories that I've made here. Oh my God, dude, it's actually like hitting me. This is so crazy, so. We did it. We packed up everything and we no longer live in this apartment. The craziest part about moving is saying goodbye to the previous chapter of your life and moving on to what's coming next. It's one of those moments where this is, this apartment symbolized like a new beginning for myself where I was able to afford a nice apartment, move to where Claudia was and start our life together and stuff. And now that this is the end of the apartment chapter, it's just very crazy. Very, very crazy. I forgot my wallet, damn it. I would not be in this position without you guys and we're on the road to 5 million subscribers this year. So please scroll down, hit the subscribe button, help us achieve more. I love you guys so much. I cannot wait to see what content is made in this house and for the rest of the year. So hit the subscribe button and I really, really appreciate it. Honey, I'm home. We are unpacking. The house is a massive wreck right now. It'll be put together eventually in the next few days. Wow, I cannot believe we live in a house. Now this house has everything you could imagine. Multiple rooms, a basement for a gym. But I think instead of telling you, why don't I give you a tour? Oh, hey there. I didn't order a pizza guy. Come in. Welcome into me and Claudia's new home. So in here first, we're rocking a beautiful state of the art office, okay? Over here is where the dance floor goes and you could literally break down like no tomorrow. This is one of my favorite rooms just because of how much space and light there is. I don't always have a fireplace, but when I do, it's in my brand new home. Yeah, that's right, baby. We have a big, huge, girthy kitchen in here, okay? This is where, this is where the magic happens, okay? Get on there, babe. Dangerous place for us to be. Oh, give me a kiss. <laughs> you know, we got the stove, blah, blah, blah. We got a brand new fridge, but the problem is, is that it's too big. It's five inches too big. Like, listen guys, five inches is always gonna be too big, but especially with a fridge, too much. Way too much, right babe? Five inches is too big. Huge, massive. Me and Claudia are settling the debate of who's getting this room. I want you guys to comment below who's gonna get this. You're not getting this room. Yes, ma'am. This is the main bedroom me and Claudia are going to be Weird enough, making babies in one day. One day, babe, not yet. Over here, we have a massive two, maybe three person bathtub. This is my side of the bathroom. I really like it. I also had no choice. We have a walk-in, double-headed, double-person shower. What I'm about to show you is gonna be a part of a project that is gonna be so massive, it's going to change all gym bros around the world. Come with me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Relentless Future Gym, all right? We are going to make the most bad, most amazing state-of-the-art gym to ever exist in a house, in a basement, in the world. But there's one spot, and I know the gym bros are gonna appreciate this and like this probably more than the finished basement. And welcome to the dungeon! Dun, 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 dun! This is where, so I'm thinking multiple stripper poles, platforms for dancers, great time with the boys. Maybe I'll put a deadlift platform and have a powerlifting meet, I don't know. Now that you guys know what this house looks like, it's time to show the rest of our friends and family. Our house, our rules. I'm wearing a cowboy hat tonight. We're throwing our first party in our first ever home. Everyone's gonna show up, we're gonna have a splendid time, and let's just say we have 
Quite a bit of drinks ready to go. Might need more. More drinks? Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a good night, isn't it? No. Yeah, let's go! Come on in, boy! Welcome home! Woo! Yeah! What do you think of the humble abode, baby? It's incredible. Is it beautiful or what? Well, you know, I'm moving in. I your maid. This house is gorgeous. Hello. 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 Thank you, thank you. All right. Here we go! Come on, guys! Yeah! I gotta liven this party up. No party's gonna be lame in my house. But you're cleaning it up. Hell, whoa! This is a two-way street, girl. This was your idea. It was my idea. I did sign up for this. If you enjoyed today's video, please subscribe. And do not forget... Stay relentless. Peace.